So I made some running boards for the car, and uh, they look like this, and they're connected on like this. But, uh, and that all works fine, but the problem is that the extension here keeps falling off. And also, they're a little bit wobbly. Um, so I'm going to fix that. Here's the pieces. And uh, so I think I need to add some sort of reinforcement to the bottom. Maybe like a steel strap that goes across and holds these on. Because these pegs always come out and come loose. And uh, they've never really been sturdy enough to begin with. So let's try that. So I've cut some pieces of steel up into perfect, well, they were supposed to be perfect one and a half inch squares, but it turns out they're, they're just kind of square-ish, one and a half inch-ish. That's fine. It doesn't have to be perfect. So these are going to sit on the other side of this, and then I'm going to have another bar that I'm going to cut, and it'll weld on like that, and then uh, that'll... That'll be nice and strong. So that's what we'll do next. Okay, I got all these pieces cut out, and uh, now I just gotta drill holes in them before I weld them on, because they're a lot more pain to drill than before than after. After than you know what I mean. So here's how I'm doing it. I've got these pieces, and I made a little drake. So let's turn the drill on. using here no holes in it. Boom. Easy as that. Okay, the pads are done. There they are, some pads. And these are ready to weld on, so let's do it. Dad, what are you doing? I'm welding. Can I put your glasses on? Everything's green. Put the glasses yeah. on. Thank <laughs> you. 
have gloves. What's that? So then you won't get. So then when you like go near it, it won't hurt your hand so much. Yeah. All right. So here it is, all installed. I've got these hooked up. Uh, I had to cut some notches in the boards, and you can see that the boards are now starting to break where I cut the notches out. So that's kind of coming apart. Maybe I shouldn't have done that, but, you know, live and learn, I guess. So, um, that went together. This has broken off also, so I gotta put some screws back in there. Maybe glue that together or something. Uh, or maybe just replace this whole thing. This I repaired because this board broke. I think Anna ran into something and uh, and broke this board all up. So I tried to repair it, but the repair wasn't the greatest. So that might need to be fixed at some point. But on the other side, I think this worked pretty well. So this one is real solid. And... Uh, turned out real nice and I've got braces up underneath in here you can see way up in there so there's a brace running up uh, up into the the structure and uh, it just when you push down on it these push up and uh, let me get a better angle from over here yeah anyway when you when you step down on the step then those push up on the underside of the, the uh, floor structure, I guess. And that is real solid and has worked really well. So uh, passenger side, eh, I might take it apart or something. We're, we're thinking about selling this van pretty soon anyway. So, um, But this side has worked really well ever since I put it on and I'm glad that project turned out. Okay, so I, I actually went back and fixed this. So now this is this is back together. Put these screws back in and put a couple screws in here. So now this is real solid. And uh, this one actually doesn't seem to be causing any problems. It's it's split, but it doesn't look like it's actually broken. So I don't know. I'm leaving it for now. If, uh, if it becomes a problem, we'll fix it later. Anyway, wooden running boards. They're a maintenance nightmare. <laughs>